Hi everybody. Hi everybody, this is MXUX. It's 11-11 uh, on June, uh, what is it, 16th today? Anyway, uh, Lordstown Motors is now at 10. Here's the daily chart. You can see this big bump up here from uh, 9 to 10, now back down to 10. Um, let's just check the real-time trades and see what's going on there um looks like we're at about ten dollars we got a lot of volume spikes here um we could just go to the chart real quick and let's just go to the chart for one day here there we go and you can see that is just a bombing uh, bomber look at that look at that jump okay and uh, where are we well we got uh, parabolic trending up I don't know if we have the Bollinger Bands contracting but we're we're pushing outside the band here uh, this is the moving average. These are your parabolics. They're coming to a point, but now we're trending up on the parabolics. And it looks like this is going to contract. Anyway, we're having a pretty good day on Lordstown stock today. And the reason for this is, let's just go to the news here. And I hope, here we go. Lordstown has binding orders for first two years of production. President, this is Rick Schmidt. Former Tesla head of production, made president, and uh, anyway, bind. Okay, there's no, no dis misunderstanding here. Binding orders for first two years of production. Okay, uh, Lordstown Motors president said on Tuesday, electric vehicle start has firm and binding orders for the first two years of production of the pickup. A week after saying it had no binding orders for the vehicle sending shares up 10 percent lordstown motors president said on tuesday the electric truck firm and by has firm and binding orders for two years of production of its pickup truck a week after saying it had no binding orders we currently have uh, currently we have enough production for 21 and 22. those are firm orders that we have had and we have had those for two years I don't know the exact facts or the legal aspect of that, but they're basically binding orders that are committed here in the last two weeks, reconfirmed orders. So I think uh, uh, that are committed here in the last two weeks, and that's uh, reconfirmed orders. Uh, they're pretty solid, and I think that's on the light or conservative side. So all this has happened in the last two weeks, and uh, as you know, uh, the CEO and the CFO um, both uh, uh, also um, uh, resigned or were fired here in the last week. Anyway, I wanted to get this news out quickly. Uh, so uh, confirmed here in the last two weeks. Okay. Now we'll see if Hindenburg has a go at this too. We have enough orders for production in 21 and 22. Okay. And by the way, uh, the board reconfirmed that they do have, they will start production in September. And I was going to make another video on this. I have a lot more information, but I wanted to get this information out first. All right. Thanks, guys.